I'm wearing leather and a blazer. So I feel like we are ready to get serious. If you have to point out the fact that I am just wearing a bra, I just want to say to you all that during the summer and spring and some places even all year round, guys walk around on beaches showing off their nipples and their boobs to all the people. Me, I am just here, I'm on camera and I'm wearing a beautiful bra that I paid a lot of money for. I could be standing here but naked and still not asking for it. Hello guys and welcome to a new video! It's June! Which means what, my fellow gays? It is Pride Month! Although I think that Pride should just be an everyday thing, but I do appreciate that we have this month where we really, really just do it a little bit extra. Usually every June is like you have a lot of things to look forward to because guess what happens in June? Pride parades! Oh, wait a minute! Coronavirus! So yeah, Pride Parades are not happening this year, which is a bit sad, but nevertheless, it is June! We are here, we are queer, and we are always filled with existential fear. Yeah. Since it's Pride Month, I thought I would do myself a little bit extra. As you see, I am wearing a little bit more makeup than usual today. How does that feel? I feel queer. I'm just kidding. I feel like myself, but I usually don't wear so much makeup, so when I actually see myself in a little square next to the camera, I'm a bit like, but it's okay, I kind of I like it, but I suck at makeup, so if you want to judge my makeup, you are allowed to do that, but just remember that I will be very sad. Anyways, Pride Month is a time of the year where we have some extra time and energy to actually think about the fact that we are living in a crazy world where people are not allowed to be themselves. I just want to say to you out there who thinks that homosexuality is wrong or bisexuality is wrong or who, everyone out there who says that there are only two genders or that transgender males or females are not real males or females. I just want to say to you that <laughs> you're stupid. You may now leave. Come back when you're a decent human being and not an annoying little homophobic, transphobic, genderphobic prick. Well, there we go. Now, for those of you who may be wondering, why am I speaking so much about the LGBTQ plus community? Well, to put it in a nice way for you, I am a bisexual woman, which means that I am attracted to both dick and pussy. No, but honestly, I am a very openly bisexual woman. And the reason I think it's very important to um, stand up for the LGBTQ plus community is because it's very simple. We are all humans. I really don't understand what people's problem is. Because honestly, what's the deal? If I want to fuck someone, does that have anything to do with you? I'm just tired of it. I'm done with it. And what I also want to point out here, we have bigger problems to focus on rather than who's fucking who? How does it work? We have other things to worry about. So many other things that you should actually worry about. For example, climate change. For example, mm, uh, I don't know, maybe some kind of global virus that might kill you or war. I mean, there are many other things that should be higher up on your list we are just born attracted to different things. And I think it's very simple because if you are a person who doesn't understand, let me just explain a little something for you. So let's say, hypothetically, there is a group of guys and they are all straight. I can assure you 100% that every guy has different tastes. They like different things in a woman. For example, one guy likes brunettes, one guy likes girls with no boobs, one guy likes girls with big boobs. Whatever you like, everyone is different. Everyone has their own preferences when it comes to beauty. We are all different when it comes to beauty and what we are attracted to. Because I can assure you, if you are straight, there are some people of the opposite gender that you are not attracted to. Me, for example, I don't think that all girls are attractive. I don't think that all guys are attractive. No, I have specific types. The only different thing for me is that I don't care what's in between their legs. A lot of people, they care about what's in between the legs because they don't really get attracted to anything else. But it's just as simple as a guy liking brunettes and a guy liking blondes. It's like a straight guy and a gay guy. It's the same thing. You have different preferences of beauty, you have different preferences of what you get attracted to as a person. It's not so complicated. I don't know if you get that metaphor. I thought it was like a metaphor that would be quite easily to understand, but I'm not sure if you get it. And if you don't get it, I just have one thing to say to you. Just don't be a cunt. 
Just be a decent human being, because we are all humans. Our worth is the same, no matter who you are, where you're from, what sexual orientation you have, what gender you identify with, what color you are. Doesn't matter, we are all humans and we should be treated as such. Okay, we've been talking about some deep shit, getting into that gay shit. I don't have much more to say today and I'm sweating so much. We're gonna wrap this video up. But what I wanted to say is basically just enjoy this month be proud of who you are. If you are a person who is a part of the LGBTQ plus community and you feel scared or you feel alone, I just want you to know you, you, you my friend are not alone. You are beautiful, you are fantastic, you are a bundle of joy and sparkles. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it in one way or another If you like this video, just give this video a thumbs up And if you want to see more of me, don't forget to subscribe to my channel uh, down below That was a little bit of a head gesture for you And uh, also if there's something you want to tell me or if you have some thoughts Write me a comment. Let me know what you guys think about this whole shit. See you guys around as soon as possible I love you. Enjoy this pride month and be proud of yourself every day. Bye! Oh my god! Celebrate and be proud. I go crazy when I see my hair. And Pride Month is a day. I'm just here thinking about pussy. Oh yeah, I'm love a six it.